hi welcome back to rebecca's travels or if you're watching my lifestyle channel welcome back to rebecca's lifestyle today i'm going to be doing a, a video on the latest travel news worldwide part one so if you haven't subscribed to my channel please subscribe it is free and i upload at least three to six times a week and so i upload regularly and um, all you need to do is press the mm -hmm. red and white subscribe button and also the notification bell click the notification bell and it'll every time i upload a video uh, you'll get to know about it so let's fire away with uh, the latest travel news worldwide part one vlog so according to breakingtravelnews.com i have got 11 fantastic brand new travel facts um so let's fire away with the first fact is number one the world Tra uh, travel awards honors the maldives with top indian ocean prize wow this is fantastic and really good uh, for the maldives islands um it is a top story. The Arch E Pelejo was presented with a trio of trophies. Wow, they've done extremely well in the Maldives to get these three trophies. And they are for Indian Ocean leading destination, Indian Ocean leading beach destination and indian ocean le uh, leading dining destination so wow um good luck for the uh, future for the maldives and um, they look absolutely stunning so moving on now to um norwegian airlines um unfortunately 1600 jobs um, have gone um, the government have rejected Norwegian Airlines uh, funding play the, uh, that's the latest airline news um, Norwegian Airline argues its operations are unsustainable in the light of travel restrictions imposed in the wake of a COVID-19 pandemic which actively discourages passengers from travelling. Um, this is ever so sad and my heart goes out uh, to Norwegian Airlines and um, the people's uh, jobs that have been lost. Um, um, again, I really hope um that norwegian airlines is saved um along with any other airline in the same situation or company in the same situation number three service departments weather covid19 storm in the uk hotel uh, that's another hotel loot news uh, trading across europe service departments has proved more resilient during the pandemic than other parts of the hospitality industry despite the obvious decline in performance so again well done to service departments for that um a lot of people have probably been using apartments um to go on holiday rather than ho choosing hotels um because a lot of people like self catering now number four um mon Dorian Gold Coast uh, is taking their brand to Australia. Wow, I really hope the brand does well in Australia. 
and if it does then hopefully um, there'll be more countries using that brand number five unfortunately Tiri cancels trips to see Santa at Lapland or in Lapland um, so that is um, again hot horrible horrible news um it's because again of the covid19 uh pandemic uh, but um anyway if there's any children watching don't worry santa will be coming down the trimley on christmas eve um so don't worry about that um number six with air launches carbon offsetting programs which is again really good news for Wizz Air and um, obviously making the environment healthier as well and at number seven six cents botanic to open in brazil next year so really hope um, it goes well fingers crossed and hopefully oh, uh, they'll get plenty of customers number eight Tanique's Tarisco travel event wow is to take place in person in September next year so hopefully all the COVID-19 um, has gone away and fingers crossed the event can go ahead as usual and i wish i wish it the best of luck number nine the future of norwegian airlines is uncertain as again the government denies um further aid um it's really horrible situation and I hope Norwegian Airlines do come through it, fingers crossed. Hopefully they can get some other support. Um, number 10, um, my AMI in the USA leads the 2020 North America World Travel Awards. So well done to my AMI. I've been to Orlando in florida but i haven't been to my hammy again it does look like um, a nice place to go and visit if you get the chance or if i do get the chance um in in future years so well done and uh, last but not least kenya takes the top spot at africa's world travel awards so well done to kenya for that and um again that's a look in the the future um with travel and tourism so thank you for watching and i'll see you tomorrow um with another vlog on both my lifestyle and my travel channel and um, it's going to be a celebrity travel special number four so please keep watching and um, please stay safe um, in these tough times and so please keep watching and um, I'll see you tomorrow and uh, bye for now thank you bye